Where you met your spouse or even where you had your first date may be a place you never forget. Now, one Kelloland restaurant is making sure those first dates are remembered. In tonight's Eye on Kelloland, Sarah McDonald takes you to Charlie's Pizza, where for many people, it was love at first slice. There aren't many restaurants in Yankton that have been around for 60 years. Charlie's Pizza House is one of the few exceptions. In those 60 years, many couples have had their first dates here, or even met at the restaurant known for its celebrity-inspired slices of pizza. Jean and Mike Binder met here back in the summer of 1977. I was a part-time waitress here. I was taking a summer class over at Mount Marty College. At that time, I was single, obviously, and uh, I didn't know how to cook, so I came up here all the time to eat. I had a friend that was a bartender here. One day, Gene says to my friend, hey, I got a flat tire. Would you come help me change it? And he said, yeah, sure. Well, I knew my friend real well, and I could tell by the way he said it, he wasn't coming. So when he walked around the corner, I said, Gene, come here. I said, I'll come by your house. And that's the start of this couple's love story. Changed the tire, and that's all I was going to do. That's all I was going to do. And then it's like, you know, your mind and your mouth aren't working at the same time. And I look at her and I go, so why don't we do something? And she goes, well, you know, what do you mean, L like a date? And I said, yes, like a date. And, uh, and then we started dating, and four years later, here we are. It's just one of the many relationships that started here at Charlie's. Yeah, Stories like the Binders led owner Chuck Rezak to put out this Facebook post, asking people to list their first date in the comments. I kind of wanted to throw it out there just to see what we could find, and the response was pretty awesome. I think we saw the Facebook page said it, 22,000 people saw it, and there was like about 60 different comments. To help honor those love stories, you'll now find these plaques on the walls. We're just starting to put in little plaques, little hearts that uh, have the dates and names on it and so forth, and we want to just kind of keep continuing that if somebody has their first date, we want to be able to keep adding on to it and you know find out what it's like in another 60 years. Rezac says the stories keep coming in. It's quite a few different people just come in and be like, oh, this is our first date. And it's it's cool hearing stories about that. You know, it kind of feels like this restaurant's kind of like everybody's from Yankton's own restaurant. So I want to keep getting the community involved in different things like that. So 40 years of marriage later, it's the perfect place for this couple to keep sharing memories. The pizza's really good, yeah, and you know, it's, there, you know, there's a sentimental part to this, but it's mostly the pizza. For sure it's sentimental reasons, um, but yeah, it's a great atmosphere. The pizza's absolutely delicious. Um, I'm biased, you know, I met my husband here, but a lot, of, a lot of really positive memories with family and friends. With Eye on Killaland, I'm Sarah McDonald. Rezac says he will continue collecting the information of couples who had first dates there. That's a cool story. I that like is really it. Really sweet. Yeah. <laughs> After more than.